Hello class 10. So welcome to today's online class. So today I have come with a new question from the chapter matrices. So very important question. So let us begin this question children. Given A matrix A is 2 0 minus 1 7 and I I actually means identity matrix. So sometime what happens uh, the identity matrix value may not be given. But here they have given but even if it is not given please remember it the value of i that is identity matrix is i means identity matrix that is 1 0 0 1 that means one of the diagonal will be 1 1 each the other diagonal will be 0 0 each. So such type of matrix where one diagonal is at least one diagonal is at least a 1 1 and the other is 0 0 such matrices such matrix is called identity matrix and a relation is given a square equal to 9 a plus m i find m so value of a is known i is known you have to find the value of m here m is not a matrix m is a number can be 2 3 4 5 so you have to find the value of m had it been matrix then they would write find matrix m but when they are saying only find x find y find m we have to understand that you have to find a number not a matrix so our solution will start so i will write that given part a square equal to 9 a plus small m small letter m and i i is identity a matrix value of a you have to apply two times a square means mul a multiplied two times so value of a is 2 0 minus 1 7 but you need to write two times 2 0 minus 1 7 equal to 9 a 9 a means multiply 9 with the matrix a 2 0 0 uh, 2 0 minus 1 7 this is the value of a plus m i where i is 1 0 0 1 so we have put all the value now we have to find the value of m now we will multiply these two matrices so the first row will multiply with first column first element with first second element with second 2 to the 4 then comes the plus symbol 0 into minus 1 is 0 because anything multiplied with 0 is 0 next 2 0 will multiply with 0 7 because the first row first row will multiply with second column so first with first 2 into 0 is 0 plus second with second 0 into 7 is also 0 because multiplying with 0 is 0 now time is time to take second second row second row will multiply with the first column first with first second with second minus 1 into 2 minus first with first minus 1 into 2 is minus 2 2 1 ja, 1 2 ja, 2 and minus 2 in the middle comes the plus 7 into minus 1 is minus 7 so second with second so first one with first second one with second now same second row with second column minus 1 into 0 is 0 plus 7 7 are 49 second with second so children if you still have problem with the multiplication i will request you rewind this multiplication portion very carefully because it's very simple sorry we take first row then we take first column then we take same first row but second column next comes second row first column second row second column so that way we multiply now equal to 9 will now this 9 will enter inside and multiply 9 to the 18 9 into 0 0 9 into minus 1 minus 9 9 1 9 9 7 63 and plus here what you can do you can multiply this one also with all the matrices so if you multiply with all this number then it will become m 0 0 m because multiplying with 0 it will become 0 but with 1 m 1 the m that way you have to multiply now you simplify here 
children be very careful that when there is equal to symbol here we put arrow on at the first 4 plus 0 is 4 0 plus 0 is 0 here 0 and this is 4 now minus 2 and this plus into minus is minus minus 7 minus 2 minus 7 is minus 9 0 plus 49 very easy it is 49 equal to here what you do you, you you may not be able to add 18 and m you will be in problem so what you do uh, you can bring this matrices here and this one that side and then by interchanging you can do so here what you do key, write the same and in the next step you interchange this matrices so i wrote the same here whatever was here same thing i wrote so now in the next step what I am going to do, I am going to may, uh, bring all the right hand side matrices to the left hand side and left hand side to the right hand side because I have to find the value of M. So M is in the wrong side because whosoever value we find you know it should be kept in the left hand side. Some of the students they interchange at the end and some of them interchange at the first. So your wish I am interchanging now but if somebody feels that I will interchange later sir no issue you can interchange later also so now i am interchanging so bring this 18 0 minus 9 63 and this plus while interchanging symbol doesn't change whatever is same same because here the side is changing the whole numbers this is going there and that is coming here so that in that case only side changes but the symbol doesn't change but only when one quantity or one element changes its side, then there is a matter of plus and minus also. So now there is lack of space. Now I will go up here. So I am going to erase this part. So you have to find the value of M. So we have to find the value of M. So let us see what happens. Now, now you take this matrix that side and keep this matrix here only so m 0 0 m will remain here and this matrix as it is plus here when it will go that side it will become minus with the matrix 4 0 minus 9 49 so this matrix is here and this will become minus why minus because there is plus here so this will go that side then it becomes minus and rest the interior part will be same so it is 18 0 minus 963 so write the same 18 0 minus 9 and 63 same thing i wrote here now write the same here so we are finding the value of m children so it's now almost about to finish here so 4 minus 18 very easy 4 minus 18 is minus 14 because this is plus 4 this is minus 18 so minus is larger so we subtract and 18 minus 4 is 14 and minus symbol because the minus number is larger 0 minus 0 is 0 second with second third with third 9 and this is minus into minus is plus you know minus into minus is plus so minus 9 plus 9 is 0 very simple and 49 minus 63 minus 63 49 minus 63 will be your minus 14 because minus 49 and plus uh, sorry plus 49 and minus 63 you have to subtract so 63 minus 49 is 14 as minus number is larger so minus 14 because this minus enters inside now you can compare by comparing so by comparing you can compare anyone this one with this one or this one with this one but in both the cases answer is minus 14 why here also the place of m is taken by minus 14 and here also the place of m is taken by minus 14 first with first second with second third with third fourth with fourth that way we compare so finally i can say by comparing we get the value of m as minus 14 so the value of m is minus 14 children this is what we got the answer so value of m is minus 14 i hope children you understood thank you children class 10 children welcome to today's online class
so today i have come again with a very important question so let us start this question so chapter is matrices so given here given the value of b matrix b is 1 1 8 3 and you have to find matrix x and the relation given is x equal to b square minus 4b that means we will put the values of b and then we will try to find the value of matrix x that means by putting the value of b here we will get the value of x so first answer we will get very easily next and hence solve for a and b so you have to find the value of a and b and the relation given is matrix x multiplying with that a matrix a and b and is equal to 5 50 5 and 50 so you can see here children there are two rows and two columns here that means matrix b is of 2 into 2 size or we also say the order of matrix b is 2 into 2 where two rows and two columns are there but you can see here 550 this is 2 into 1 size matrix or we can say the order of this matrix is 2 into 1 because there are two rows this is the first row only single element but this is first row single element this is second row but there is only one column so this is 2 into 1 size so you can see here you have to find the value of x so first let us try to find the value of x so my solution begins here and i will write this first x equal to matrix x equal to b square minus 4b so here i will try to find the value of x because you have to find x so you can write arrow and then use x again and again or you directly can write equal to and start the work no issue so b value you can put here so it is b square means b b's value you have to put two times one one eight three because square means two times multiplication so one one eight three two times i wrote so this is our b square value minus 4b 4b means 4 will multiply with the value of matrix b that is 1 1 8 3 so here again i write matrix x equal to now i will multiply this so you all know how to multiply i have taught in my last videos the first row will multiply with first column first with first element second with second element so first element is 1 and 1 so 1 1 are 1 then in the middle we put plus second with second 1 into 8 is 8 then a small gap we write a small gap we put here then the first row the same first row with second column first with first so 1 1 are 1 plus 1 second with second 1 3 is a 3 next comes your second row with first column so second row first element 8 and here first element is 1 8 1 is a 8 plus second with second 3 8 is a 24 now same second row with second column so first with first 8 1 is a 8 plus 3 3 is a second with second 3 3 is a 9 so our multiplication is over here the single number is is going to multiply with every element so easy it will go inside so what will happen now 4 1 is a 4 again 4 1 is a 4 4 8 is a 32 4 3 is a 12 so now next what we will do matrix x equal to we will simplify this we will add it 8 plus 1 9 1 plus 3 4 8 plus 24 32 8 plus 9 17 so after adding this is our result so this is the addition result and now we have to subtract with 4 4 3 2 and 1 2 now it's final time now we will get the value of x now what we will do just now we multiplied now it's time to subtract the matrices this is called subtraction of matrices so first element with first 
subtraction and addition is so easy children very easy 5 minus 4 is 5 4 minus 4 is 0 32 minus 32 is 0 17 minus 12 is 5 so this is the answer of matrix x so find x so matrix x is 5 0 0 5 now second part is remaining here second part second part means they are saying here find a b solve a b and this relation is given so for second part we will start write this given part x a b equal to 5 50 now one good thing about this question is that now we know the value of matrix x matrix x value is 5005 now we will put that value of x here and we will try to find the value of ab so value of x is just now we got 5005 so value of matrix x is this and we have a b and equal to 550 so children here very interesting this is 2 into 2 size matrix, 2 rows, 2 columns, you can see 2 rows, 2 columns. But this is 2 into 1 size matrix, 2 rows, single element, first row, second row, but only 1 column. So, 2 into 2 size matrix is multiplying with 2 into 1 size matrix and the result also is 2 into 1 size matrix. So, this is very important. Now, we will try to find the value of AB. It's time to multiply. Rule is same. And this multiply, this multiplication is going to become more easier because there is only one column. There is no second column. So, our work will finish very fast. Now, you see, first row only with first column. That is first element with first second element with second. So, 5 into A, it is 5A plus second with second 0 into b is 0 so nothing to write here because there is no second column had there been second column one more group would come here but you know like, just like you see first group second group third group fourth group but here only one group the second group is missing because it is only two into one size two rows one column so due to one column nothing comes here now Second row with first column, zero, first with first, 0 into A, 0, plus 5 into B, 5B. It's over. It's over because nothing to write in the second and fourth line, fourth one, fourth element because it's only 2 into 1 size. So, equal to 5 and here 50 now what we will do we will add this to so easy very easy because 5a plus 0 is 5a children please note it down it is addition not multiplication that's why 5a plus 0 is not 0 but it is 5a itself and 0 plus 5b is 5b so it has also become 2 into 1 size 2 rows but 1 column and here also we have 2 into 1 size 2 rows but 1 column so now it's time to compare now we will compare so due to lack of space i am going to erase this side so we will compare it now so comparing time we have to write by comparing by comparing so comparing time is very easy first will be compared with first right left hand side will be compared with right hand side first with first second with second so we can say therefore 5a 5a will be equal to 5 so we can say arrow a equal to 5 by 5 therefore value of a will be equal to 1 5 by 5 is 1 and second one also we will compare therefore 5b equal to 50 and b will be equal to 50 by 5 so therefore b equal to 10 because 
5 10 ja 50 so our value of a is 1 answer value of b is 10 this is our answer and value of x we have already got that is value of x is uh, already here i have erased it it was 5005 0, 0, 5. so one more time also if you want to write here you can write otherwise no issue so this was a very important question children and very easy question as well so watch my video very carefully and learn these questions thank you children